The Pet Simulator Christmas update is about to be here in five minutes. And oh my gosh, I have heard this update is actually really, really, really massive. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead like quickly jump and the update will be here by the time I finish jumping. So, uh, and it is finally here, bro. Update to, oh my God, new areas, new pets, new eggs, new upgrades. There's so much stuff. And we're gonna go on every single one of those things. So firstly, we have the advent rewards, which are available now. And it looks like you get the advent rewards by completing a quest every day for a new reward every single day the first one is break 200 candy canes where do you get candy canes i have no idea but we're gonna find out and right here we have combined presents make better presents but i have no presents yet you also have these ornaments bro wait how do i place one look at what these people are saying titanic drop on 12 July 17 at 11 a.m cst that one is preston's bro how do i get ornaments man i just want an ornament to blaze down well let's go ahead claim our social rewards and everything here maybe this will give us it i don't know how you even get them but let's just go and collect everything so there's a brand new clan war right here as you guys can see every single clan actually has a point system now this is what i was waiting for for the longest period of time and what you can do with this is wait shout what is this enter a clan status winning bro that is gonna be our clan status and yeah i don't know what that does but as you can see we can collect or open the most presents and if we do open the most presents we could possibly get this huge present for being the number one clan and i don't know if you guys know but i am a hardcore grinder bro we do not stop winning but i will talk about that more later on however let's go all the way to area 58 because we have five brand new areas to check out firstly being with area 59 and oh there's a candy cane okay that's what we were looking for let's go break one and it doesn't give us candy how can it be a candy cane but with no candy okay let's go by area 59 uh, you should spend your coins. The price of this gate has been increased to prevent skipping. What does that mean, bro? I have no idea. Wait, why? It just took all my coins. I didn't know they meant that it was going to wipe your coins every time you buy an area, bro. Are you serious? Okay, well, now we're in area 61 with absolutely no coins because this game decided to scam me last second. But that is fine. What we can do is go ahead and just pop a lot of boost as well as actually equip some really OP books. If you guys didn't know, critical books are so overpowered, bro. This book is insanely good. I'm going to go ahead and equip that as well as a coins book. Or let's go ahead and do fortune. Um, Midas touch or actually no. We're going to do strong pets as well as a coins book. So let's go ahead and get a coins book. There we go. There we go now we're getting coins very fast and we can actually break the stuff i'm also gonna go ahead and pop some boost real quick to make this just a lot faster and smoother we can also go ahead and eat every single fruit talking about fruits they actually have some brand new ones firstly though let's go ahead and get our little coins upgrade so now we're getting plus 10 percent more coins which is always nice to have but there we go. We can now buy Area 61. Let's go ahead, jump through. And oh my god. Okay, 20k for the next area. But we have a cart ride into Preston. Sorry, this is disabled right now. Wait, what? Bro, the update just came out. Okay, you know what? We'll worry about that later. You know, for now, we're going to actually go ahead and spend some time here. Okay, all of the coins just decided to disappear. That's cool. Okay, we are back after it decided to eat my coins for the second time. But there is a present here. Yo, okay, present discovered. And that's a small Christmas present. Okay, well, it says one out of 50. Does that mean there is more? Bro, where else do we get more of those? But let's go ahead and open it for some goodies. And okay, we just got a pineapple, which is like kind of bad. And some other stuff. 
Wait, so I'm assuming me doing that has now actually gained our clan some points. Oh my god, what? Wait, how do we have 1.25k? I mean, yeah, we did get a point since I did do that. And it looks like every clan now is like um by region, so that is pretty cool. Here's our clan. Currently, we're number six, but soon I promise you guys we'll be number one. And I think everybody can see this winning thing. Anyways, let's go ahead go to the next area bro and area 62 next area i think is the last one yeah there it is and then we have a new countdown let's go and open some gift bags as well i have a lot of them see if we can get anything good i want an ornament bro i have no idea how to get an ornament i want to put one on a little tree man we do need to go ahead and hatch new pets soon though because this like stuff is very hard to break i think i can uh no if i use a tnt it still wouldn't actually be good just because we're not doing a lot of damage right now Let's go ahead and open my large gift bags. I have a bunch of those. Come on, bro. Give me something new from the update. Is there anything I can get? And no, we didn't get anything good. We got a gift bag. Um, Is that going to give me anything good? No. Also, there's this new reward thing which says invite friends get rewards. So you can invite a friend and help them reach area 15 and both of us get an award of 100k gems. And it does say only real players are legible, which makes sense. They probably have some sort of protection on it. But here's the snow merchant items for sale. Snowball launcher, bro. Okay, let's go and get all of this stuff. I want to see what I can do with this. I just bought a ton of snowballs, bro. We have literally an unlimited amount of snowballs now. Where is my snowball launcher, bro? Hold on. Where is this thing? There it is. A click to equip. And can I just shoot it at people? Oh my god, I can. It's just like the one from Pet Sim, except I think this one's actually a little bit more improved on how it works. We'll go ahead and test it out in the trading plaza later, but let's get this magnet upgrade too. That is actually amazing because now we might be able to reach the whole area. They did also not add any brand new ranks in this update, so we can't equip any more pets. Also, bro, I just noticed I don't even have all my pets equipped. I am reading these ornaments, bro. Use code. Whoa, hold up. Somebody else is advertising. Wait, hold on. You smell. Wow, I, I, I'm a little bit sad about that, man. Let's see if there's anything in the shop. Oh, wait, I think this is how you get the ornament. Oh, my God, it is. Limited time holiday pack. Okay, let's go ahead and get that. It gives us a hoverboard and a bunch of other cool stuff. Let's go ahead and buy it. Why not? And there we go. Successful. Wait, I can buy more? No way. You're telling me I can pay to win this new update. Bro, it is over, man. If you're telling me I can go ahead just keep buying these forever this is gonna be insane and it's only 600 robux so it's not even a bad price bro i can just go i keep buying these and you get a bag of diamonds plus large christmas presents and cookies which i uh, give you uh 10 more damage for five minutes not bad bro well, there we go. We just got a bunch of rewards, bro. Some of the ornaments. Oh, my God. Wait, this is a gold ornament? That is an exotic. Okay, let's go ahead and go all the way back to the spawn. I'm going to leave my stuff here. But let's go ahead and buy some of the brand new pets, bro. We got a bunch of new eggs. And here we go. Let's go ahead and get all of them. And looks like every pet in this egg is a mythical. By the way, fun fact, they did increase the chances of huge pets. And I think they buffed, like, all of the luck stuff. I don't know. But it is a lot easier to not get huges. And let's go ahead and hatch some of this. So, um, let's see. Okay, I think I have enough coins. So, we can go ahead and do it. And let's see what we get. Okay, we got a bunch of cool little pets. Yeah, it definitely looks like we're doing a lot more damage over there, bro. How good are these? Oh, my God. It's 180k for just the rainbow of that. That is insanely good, bro. We can just go ahead and keep on hatching these. Okay, we need to place an ornament, bro. Titanic's drop. Okay, press and place it on there. I don't know. Okay, you can't place it on the Christmas tree. You know what? I'm also going to go ahead and place it on this tree because why not? I, I want to see if I can press it like right next to Preston's. Can I literally put it right there, bro? Enter a short message. 
Um, use a star code and numb. Make sure you guys use star code numb, bro. It helps out a lot. That's too close to other ornaments. Man, okay, fine. We'll go ahead, go a little bit further. Use a star. Wait, star. Wait, hold on. Okay, you know what? Use star code numb heart emoji. And let's see. That's too close. Okay, I think there might be so many people trying to place it on this tree. It doesn't work. Uh, yeah, it doesn't. Also, there's a little reward right here. How did I miss this thing? But there we go. Let's go ahead and open our uh, large Christmas presents, though. We have four of them or actually no what we could do i think is combine them yeah i can make three more if i combine all of these large ones so let's go ahead do that and let's go ahead make a titanic present fun fact you can actually get a titanic pet from this and we do have four of these hoverboards. Let me know if you guys want one. I'll give away some. I genuinely don't need them. But let's go ahead and uh, open these Titanic Christmas presents. So here we go. Let's go and open it. Three, two, one. Open. And there it is, bro. It's getting massive. And okay, no, it didn't actually get that massive. But oh my god, it is giving us a bunch of cool rewards. We got a bunch of, like, the hot cocos, which makes your pet move 50% faster for 10 minutes. That is not bad a lot at all. And let's go ahead and open more of these large ones. Get some more points for the clan, bro. Oh, my God. I got a present, cat. Oh, whoa, whoa. We're getting a lot of those. Is that, like, an actual pet? Wait, present cat. Yeah, it is. But it's not that good, I will say. I still do want to place my ornaments, though, bro. I don't know why it's not, like, letting me place them anywhere. Please, bro, let me place it. No. Wait, I think I can place it on the bush, bro. Okay, no, only on trees. Um, What tree should I place it on? Okay, you know what? Let's just go ahead and go there. Come on, does it work too close? I think there's so many people that are trying to place theirs, guys, that it just doesn't work right now. So in that case, let's go ahead and just place it in side of the last area since this is the best area and i think we might be able to place it here plus there's a christmas present right there bro i am collecting all these christmas presents like ease but yeah here we go let's go and try one more time on this tree if it does not work here bro we're just gonna figure out okay yeah i'll just wait for it later i don't know why it doesn't want to work but they did also add the fruit egg, which has a titanic banana cat, as well as a huge hippo melon. And I think that is the only new thing about it. Yeah, that is. And I want to go ahead and buy some of that, bro. So let's go ahead and buy a bunch of these exclusive fruit eggs. And I'm probably just going to go ahead and buy like, I don't know, 30 of them or something. I think 30 is a good amount for now. Okay, there we go. We got a bunch of them. I think I might have bought a little bit more, but okay, no, we got 30, right? Now, let's go ahead and go to the trading plaza because one, they did something cool in there as well as I would just want to hatch them in there. So, here we go, trading plaza. Let's go ahead and go to the pro one. Why not? Okay, looks like the trading plaza is actually completely broken. Yeah, it, it just disconnects me. Okay, there we go. We're back in. And let's just go ahead and open them here, bro. Next to the Christmas tree. Please give me some luck, man. But let's go go to the eggs. Come on, open eight. Give me a Titanic. I will be the happiest man in the world if we get one. I haven't actually hatched any from exclusive eggs. And no, we did not. We do have a bunch more to open, though. So let's go ahead and open more eight more. We got to get at least one huge, bro. I am not going to let it slide without giving us one huge pet. Are you serious? No rainbows or nothing, bro. It's just not being on our side right now. Let's go ahead and equip some luck enchants. I don't even know know if it works but we're gonna take our chances on it and hopefully it does work okay here we go eight more um and isaac dev clan shouted wait what okay there we go we got nothing bro are you serious let's go and open more i mean i'm about to run out bro it's kind of sad that we didn't actually get a huge pet i'll go ahead and buy more if we have to but i want one huge pet bro is that way too much to ask for i want a titanic man just give me the huge pet i'll be happy enough with the huge i promise i'm only saying that so it gives me a titanic 
Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and buy 10 more. This is going to afford, like, Preston's dinner for the night. But, you know, let's go ahead and just do it. Please? Give me something good, bro. Ah, please, 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 please. Uh, if it's trash, I'm going to be a little bit upset. And it, it, it's trash. Bro, I have not gotten anything good. This is why I don't buy exclusive eggs. You guys keep telling me to buy them, and I get nothing good. And, yeah, th this is so unlucky, bro. What in the world? Okay, you know what? We'll come back to that soon. Also, I don't know what the new huge pets are, so I'm going to go ahead and type in huge here. See what is actually new because it says three new huge pets, but they aren't specified or like they don't exactly say how you get them. Okay, that's the huge hoverboard cat. That's not exactly what we're looking for. Um, I don't exactly know. I mean, I do know there's a brand new free to play Titanic pet. That is called the Titanic Silver Dragon. You can find this inside of the 2023 Titanic present. So yeah, it's going to be very rare. Also, there is a new huge pet that is the huge Wizard Westie. And it is inside of this chest. And I have a bunch of crystal keys. So let's go ahead and just open a bunch of these, bro. See if we can get it. That would be really nice if we got it. I'd be so happy, bro. Um... Goodbye, give it to me. I mean, I don't know what the chances are. It's probably really rare, but we can only hope. And oh, we got a charm stone. I didn't even know you could get that, but I will take it. Why not? Charms are not a bad thing. And yeah, I don't think I have too much good luck with this. I'll go ahead and open like one more for the fun. And yeah, nothing good. Let's go ahead and open the charm stone. See what charm we get. We got a glittering charm. Okay, now we need to do the Advent reward. So, it says break 175 candy canes to unlock the gift. So, I don't know what area is going to, like, have the most candy canes or whatnot. But, I guess we can just go ahead and put, like, everything inside of this area. Why not? Or, actually, we should probably do it inside of this little area over here. Since it has the most amount of, uh, space. Meaning there's a better chance that it spawns. I will go ahead and place some magnet flags so that we don't have to keep worrying about collecting the coins. But, in the meantime, while we do finish this quest, let's see how close we are. 150. Okay, yeah, it's going down pretty quick. So, in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and hatch some of the brand new egg. And, hopefully, we can get some of the best stuff. Okay, there we go. Go claim your reward in the advent calendar. And here it is. It is six small Christmas presents. I mean, it is only the first day. Right now, I would not say that is good at all. But since it's the first day, I'm going to let it slide, man. But I did hatch a lot of pets, guys. So now we do have a better team of 211k. Which, to be honest, that is an insane amount. So I'm pretty happy about that. I could definitely make it better later on. But right now, that's not what I'm worried about. What we need to do is actually collect all 50 of these presents around the map. And here's the another one. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys where literally all 50 of them are. And I would assume they have put them across every single area on the map. So, yeah, there's one, like, behind this tree. And by the way, all of these are in the same exact spots for everyone. Here is the next one. Oh, wait, we have a traveling merchant. Okay, let's go ahead and get this real quick. My bad, guys. I got a little bit sidetracked, but we need this good. Okay, there we go. But the best way to really find all of these is go through every area. For example, here's another one. And all of these are in the same exact spots. I believe it refreshes so you can collect more like every single day or something. I don't know how it exactly works, but it goes up to higher tiers. And right now, there is none so far in these last few areas that we've gone through. Okay, there's one actually behind this jungle area inside of like one of the trees. They kind of try sneaking it in. They do glow a bit similar to the shiny relic, so they're not too hard to spot i don't know if they've placed any inside the mini games i would be very upset if they have to be honest we will check out the brand new mini game too in just a second but we shall find all 50 of these because there's a cool reward at the end 
Okay, it looks like there isn't any inside of the ocean unless they tried sneaking them in again. But this is like the only way to actually find them quickly. Literally by running around the map and having your eyes completely peeled, bro. You can place them on the pop trees? Wait, that is actually really cool. Why have people put here? I hope you have a great day. Okay, I'm sure they've placed one inside of this area, bro. This area is just way too big for them not to have placed something here's another present by the way behind the boat and as you guys can see now we're getting medium christmas presents so after a certain amount that you collect it starts giving you better and better presents and here's another one inside of the rainbow machine, which is a little bit weird, but yeah, you can barely see it. You have another one inside the cactus or on top of it. There's one inside of the bush inside of, I think this is area 30 or something, bro. I, I forgot. 35. Okay, close enough. Preston shop does not have one. Oh, wait, it says trading plaza is currently disabled. We will be back shortly. Thanks for your patience. That's a cool alert. Well, the next one you can find in front of this house on the porch. There is a free present. And I think the order in which you get medium presents, titanic sized ones, and other stuff is different every time. Also, bro, since when have all of the developers been inside of the little ice things here? I could have sworn this was not here before, bro. Also, you have another one on this snowman's head, bro. Poor guy. What did they do to you, man? Another on top of this house. If you also go up all the way to the sled race, there's one behind the tree. If you go to the area after that, there's one kind in the water. It's really easy to see. There's one inside of the lava in the second, like, kind of uh, lava zone. You got one next to the pathway where the comet showers are. There's one in the dinosaur's mouth. It's kind of hard to see since there's this guy in the front. But there we go. Another present. If you go to kind of like the last lava zone, there's one in the, uh, like this little angle right here. This right angle. Yeah, I know my math. Uh, I think there was supposed to be one more in this area, unless I'm tripping, bro. Uh, where is it? Okay, maybe there isn't. I might just be wrong. Now, there is one in the dojo right there, and one behind or near the rebirth section, too. There's one in between the dojo where, like, the rare enchants machine is. And when you get to the update one areas, there's one on top of this building in the little, uh, like, hut, I guess. There's one inside the little bed bamboos uh in the second area of the first update i guess and i forgot what number we're at exactly right now but we still need a bunch more there's one in the little flower field right here that's 29 out of 50 there's one all the way at the back of this house right there there's one where the little cat clan poster is but for you guys it's probably gonna be the clan that you're in if you also keep going forward they have one in the little corner where like the little fairy castle is now we are back to the new areas they have one in this little village uh, i believe there is another one okay maybe there isn't maybe it was on the other side I, I have no idea okay what it is just not here they do have another one uh, on the other side of this little area behind the little crystals one back here next to the crystal and for the rest i think they are inside of the game modes there might be a few that i missed but let's see okay we can now go into the cart ride into preston so if we go ahead yeah as i said there's one inside the game modes right here and let's go ahead and spawn a cart i think it works literally like those old games bro yeah you just spawn a cart you sit in it and then you tell it to go oh my god there is big boy preston himself okay this is gonna take too long so i'm gonna go ahead and do a little trick and there we go now we have a hoverboard in the little area don't ask me how I did it. I just did. I'll probably make a video on how you can actually do this yourself soon. But it is still actually kind of hard to go with the hoverboard because you have to make some pretty decent jumps, bro. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't think you can actually even land on the stuff that you need to be able to land on. Let me see if I can take this shortcut of going up on top. Oh, my God. I think I can. Can I just go right into Preston, bro? Is this going to work? Okay, no, that doesn't work. Let's go and try making this jump. Okay, we can do that. And then 
If I... Oh, my God. It's hard, bro. Yeah, don't try doing this with a hoverboard, guys. It's just way too hard to do. I'm gonna go ahead and do it the normal way. Just sit down and wait like 10 minutes, bro. And in the meantime, while we wait, I do want to tell you guys that I'm releasing a brand new game today. By the time you're seeing this video, oh my god, bro, are you serious? Well, let's go back on it. But as I was saying, by the time you're seeing this video, the game is about to be out in a few hours. And I'm so excited to share what I've worked on. It's taken a long time, and I promise to update it every, like, two or three days. So go ahead, check it out. Link in the description. But Big Games is also releasing two brand new plushies, the Titanic Reindeer and the Titanic Fawn, like, tomorrow. And I want to know how many of you guys think I should buy these. And if so, how many should I buy? Because I want to buy a lot, but I also don't want to do like I, what I did before where I spent over like $5,000. It was probably not the smartest financial decision. Okay, it looks like my car kind of crashed, so it looks like we're walking the rest of the way. I absolutely hate games like this, bro. This is the most annoying thing that I could possibly be doing right now. I have not hated any obby as much as I've hated this mode, bro. And oh my god, I have to be careful not to fall off. Finally, Preston, I am coming, my friend. I am going in literally a straight path. There's possibly no way I could lose. Or at least I hope not. And oh my god, bro, Preston is looking thick today. And let's go ahead, just go right into his mouth and see what we get. Okay, there's the rewards. So you have to actually go up to it and boom, we got garbage. Wow, I'm so happy about that. There is also presents inside of the garden right in the back. And if we do go further back, I believe there is one inside of the chest rush. Where it is though is a good question because I don't even know myself. Oh yeah, here it is, right next to, like, the second to last chest, and yeah, there it was. I don't think there is any inside of the last section all the way back here, but that was one of them. Also, here's the elf on the shelf here. Make sure you guys get it because it gives you a pretty cool reward every single day. And the reward does get better and better, I believe. But overall, whenever you do actually end up collecting every single reward, and most of these can be found in the minefield and, like, all the other game modes, I don't really want to go through every one of them. Like, yeah, as you can see, there's a present all the way over there, bro, but I would actually have to get all the way to the end. And yeah, it's just gonna keep detonating. But definitely collect them all because whenever you collect all of them, you do get a Titanic present, which has a chance of giving you a free Titanic pet, bro. I mean, who doesn't love that? But yeah, this update is definitely a massive one. I'm really happy about it. I think it's a great update. But one thing I must do, bro, buy another 10 of these fruit eggs, bro, because I want my huge bet, man. I don't care what huge bet it is. Just please give me one. I want the strawberry corgi or the titanic banana cat. I don't want a hippo melon, but um, wow, there is the 100 eggs option. Glad to know that I finally spent 100,000 Robux on this game, bro. Oh my god. That is kind of depressing. I don't know if I should be happy about that. But let's go ahead and open eight of these eggs. Come on, give us something sweet. And are you serious, bro? After spending 100,000 Robux on your game, which is like $1,000, you still don't want to give me one huge pet. Oh my god, actually got nothing from them. <laughs> well, let me know if you guys have had better luck with this. But I do want to go ahead and buy a few more of these, bro, to bump up our clan, help out everybody that is inside of the clan, because we have to get first place, bro. It is not going to be competition to me if we are not first place. There we go. I have bought so many of them. Seven packs to be exact because I have 11 hoverboards. And now I think I can combine them all. So it's going to be worth more if I do combine them. So here we go. Let's go get two more of these Titanic Christmas presents. 
And we can also go ahead and combine the small Christmas presents, too. I don't know if I'll be able to get it as high. Yeah, I can't, but... Oh, no, we can get one more large. Let's go. Well, here we go. Let's go ahead and open the Titanic Christmas presents both at once because it, for some reason, gives us the option to do that. And let's see what we got. And looks like nothing too good. Oh, we got a present dragon. A candy cane unicorn snowflake pegasus. Okay, let's see the stats on those, though. I think the snowflake pegasus might be the best one. 152k! Wait, this is only a normal one, bro. That is actually insane. And I think that should bump up my number a lot higher inside the clan. Yeah, we just literally doubled. And let's go number two clan. I don't know what this evil clan is, but um, yeah, apparently they're running a very good clan. I think they're being, yeah, they are getting completely carried by this person. I don't know who that is, but that's not going to last for long. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, watch the video on the screen. It's one of my best videos yet, and I promise you will enjoy it. Until then, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day and happy holidays.